Using the light Sierra's deck. The world is at the bottom of the deck. Someone, um, something, you know, there's a massive, could be an ending, but it could lead to a new beginning. Just look at this, the lovers, the world and the lovers. A choice. <clears throat> Someone may have made a very serious choice about an ending. Someone may have traveled. The world can be travel. It can be traveled to a different country. There could have been a choice in lovers. There may be a plan. There could have been a plan. Plan may be... Just look at this, the hermit and the lovers. Um, somebody may be doing a lot of soul searching about a choice that was made. All right, so the first question I'm going to ask is how you're feeling, okay? How is, what is Aquarius seeing, thinking, and feeling, please? What is Aquarius seeing? Thinking and feeling, please. What is Aquarius seeing? Thinking and feeling. What is Aquarius seeing? Thinking and feeling, please. Okay. So an offer has been made to somebody, either you or your person. It looks good, or it looked good. Um, I mean, I've got the Knight of Cups and the Nine of Cups. You could be dealing with a Pisces or a Scorpio. Clarify this Knight of Cups offer. So I've got the number eight. Something may have been done quickly. The offer have been may have been made quickly. It may again the eight. May, it may involve travel. Um, I'm seeing the nine of cups. Um, so your person or you. This could be kind of could be something that look good. So this offer might have been made to your person, or your person might be might have made this to you, or might be thinking about making this to you. Or they might have made it to a Pisces or a Scorpio. I'm just going to look at the cards underneath. It may, I've got the Six of Swords and the Magician. So you, so you could be dealing with Scorpio, Pisces, Virgo, Gemini, another Aquarius so far. Or someone with these in their chart. I feel like somebody was being a bit of a trickster here and cooked this up. Um, I just don't know. I know. I don't know why I'm get, getting that feeling, but I'm getting that somebody was pretty crafty. Um, show me a little bit more, please. What is Aquarius seeing, feeling, intuitively knowing? What is Aquarius seeing or intuitively sensing? You could have lost everything that you wanted, or there could have been an ending to a marriage here, or there could be a rebirth. Um, there could be a transformation in an, in an existing commitment. Something could be ending so you can have your Ten of Pentacles. Show, so we've got Scorpio and Virgo here. Show me a little bit more. It's Mercury and Virgo. They're the Ten of Pentacles. There you are. Or that could be a, a karmic, okay? I don't know why I'm getting that energy. Hold on one moment. I just feel like I'm looking at someone who is looking at something that was meant for you. Um, I feel like this person is jealous of you. If you're a male Aquarius, this could be someone that you're with right now. It could be a Libra. I can get a Libra energy from that woman. Um, should I clarify the Queen of Swords? Ooh. Yeah, I'm kidding. Page of Swords and Knight of Cups. Ah. So this person, 
I feel is jealous. There, there we go. She's been watching you. Um, an offer may have been made. Sorry. So this karmic -y energy here, which I think could be a Libra. It's someone with a lot of air in their chart. They like to cut. This is a very, this is an unemotional person. Um, this person strategizes all the time. Just look at, look at what she's doing there. Sorry. She's strategizing, but she's really, sorry with the lighting guys. I just decided to do the reading in this room today. Um, she's looking at the Ten of Pentacles, which she might already have this. Your person could be there, but she's looking at it. It's like she's only happy to have it if it was something that you wanted. Just a second now. <laughs> it's just, I just keep making it worse. It's the way that she's looking at this. Okay, show me more, please. So, um, show me how Aquarius is feeling, please. Show me how Aquarius is feeling. How is Aquarius feeling? Ah, page of pentacles to the same ten of pentacles. So this, um, I feel like this is a legacy that belongs to you. And this, this is the first step toward it. You're holding this. So I feel like you're on the precipice of having everything that you want. And you're, you're really balanced very well. You look happy. Um, show me a little bit more. Yeah, so it's you that's doing some soul searching. Or, hang on. I feel like this could be somebody who is thinking about giving this to you. So I'm seeing Virgo here in Capricorn. We've got the Hermit and the Page of Pence. So you intuitively know this. Um, may I please see how Aquarius is feeling? Show me again. How is Aquarius feeling? How is Aquarius feeling? Yeah, um, you're feeling very abundant. Um, you're coming up as the Empress and the hermit but i got to say underneath the empress is the ten of swords so i feel like somebody there's been some there's an ending again but it's it's also a betrayal i feel like with respect to that ten of pentacles something was almost yours and something happened i don't know what so from aquarius's perspective what happened from Aquarius' perspective, please, what happened? A tower. So you're coming up as the Empress, a tower. All right, so we're gonna look at, see what's underneath the tower. Yeah, the Six of Pentacles. So I think you may have ended something that looked so promising in the beginning because somebody was giving to two. There was some kind of, Cheating involved is another energy coming to look at you. Um, okay. um, that could also be your person, all right? Now let's see how your person is feeling. How is Aquarius' person feeling, please? Uh, oh, they don't feel. How is Aquarius' person feeling, please? How is Aquarius' person feeling, please? Person on Aquarius' mind. How are they feeling, please? All right. So you could be dealing with a Taurus here. Sorry. A Taurus or um, any fixed sign. Leo, Scorpio. Taurus or another Aquarius. I'm going to see what's underneath the Hierophant. Yeah, so they they feel, now hang on, I'm going to clarify the world here. Because what I've got is the Nine of Cups and the Hierophant over here. So there's an, a desire for commitment with, you know, their Nine of Cups. I need to clarify what the world is. Um, clarify how Aquarius' person is feeling, please. Clarify how Aquarius is person is feeling. I'm going to do that one more time. 
they may not know how they're feeling. Clarify how Aquarius this person is feeling, please. Clarify their feelings. Jeez. Clarify their feelings. Okay. Okay, so they're feeling slightly defensive right now um, about their Nine of Cups. Show me more. Yeah, confusion. Totally confused. Confronted by emotions. That's uh, Venus and Scorpio. They may have given in to some kind of temptation there. Um, could be dealing with a Capricorn regarding this, this wonderful brand new beginning. Come back. What are they thinking about? Yeah. So I've got the King of Cups and the Four of Wands. Could be dealing with the Pisces, by the way. I feel like they're trying to figure out um, whether or not this person is full of emotion, by the way. Just, just look at this person. I feel like this person is trying to get a temperature, trying to gauge somebody's, how somebody is feeling. What is, he, what is the, why is he so emotional? Because this person is emotional. This person has had a tower about the four of wands. So about what this person actually did. Why is this person having a tower? They're hiding their emotions. I've got the four of pentacles um, and the four of wands. What is this person hiding? There's a secret that they're hiding. What is this person hiding? Yeah, they're hiding what their nine of cups really is. What is their nine of cups? What are they hiding? So they're closed up about, yeah, I knew it. So their nine of cups, there we go, the three of wands. Remember how I told you that they're looking back? It's what they're looking back at, and that's you. Let's just see what's underneath there. Yeah, that's what they were supposed to give to you. So, okay. What is Aquarius's, what, what is on Aquarius's mind? What are Aquarius's plans, please? What is it, what are Aquarius's, what are your plans? I think what your plans are to get out of this mode, because this person had you stuck and in your head for quite a while. What's this? You know, there's the Queen of Wands. I feel like that's the karmic. And, you know, there's the ending, the shift. I feel like what you're doing is you're just teaming up with your friends. I see the Three of Cups there. I don't, I see here this, um, I'm seeing this as you gathering together with your friends, with your homies, rolling with your homies. Um, but and you're taking off, you're getting out of that stress mode. Uh, yeah, because you're, <laughs> you're sailing away. This is your card, Six of Swords, from this person who's very emotional. Look at him. He's now alone, trying to cook up some kind. Look at that Eight of Wands message he's going to send, or she, whoever this is. Just a minute, guys. Okay, so we've got you still in Two of Pentacles mode, trying to decide whether or not, I think... Yeah, you're, I think that can, that is the quick trip to you or the quick communication. And what does Aquarius decide in the end? What does Aquarius decide? I think you say no. I'm looking at you in Seven of Wands mode, so that's pushing away, defending yourself. Yeah, because they're coming in like this. Aquarius, come to me. And you're saying, not a chance. I'm at my yoga class. <laughs> um, let's just for fun um, get a message or two from your person, okay? I get a couple of messages from Aquarius's person. All right, we're gonna take two, four, and six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Guys, if there were a few pieces missing in this video, it's because I just noticed um, it's not on automatic save, so it may not have automatically saved some of the segments. I'm sorry. We're going to take two, six, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one more. We're going to take one, three, and four. One two, three, and four. All right, here we go. Yeah, 
you were smart. I have things going on in my life that require my full attention. So there's a lot this person hasn't told you. This is exactly why I wish I had accepted your invitation. It could have changed everything. So you might have invited this person, um, you know, to, uh, to on some kind of a weekend trip or something, or, or at Christmas time, you might have invited them somewhere and they said no. They miss hearing your voice. Well, get ready for a lot of missing. Okay, I'm dying for you to just touch me. So you probably have healing hands. Um, we both know that I'm not the one for you. You better believe it, bro. <laughs> just kidding. Okay, I'm afraid of losing you. Yeah, that's why this person did this abrupt turnaround. Karmic partner. No kidding. This isn't over between us. I'm coming back for you. Just like in the reading. And this is you. It's too late. 